Hello there. Welcome back to Okta's support playlist. In today's video, we'll be talking about an important feature in SAML applications, the dynamic attribute statement configuration. This feature allows applications to utilize and process additional attributes sent from Okta. We'll walk you through how to locate this configuration for Okta Integration Network, or OIN, SAML applications. So let's dive right in. To begin, log in to your Okta Admin Dashboard. Once you're in, navigate to Applications by clicking on Applications from the menu, and then select Applications from the drop-down. Next, you'll need to locate the specific OIN SAML application you're interested in. Browse through your list of applications, or use the search feature to quickly find it. Once you've found it, click on it to open its Settings page. Here, head over to the Sign On tab and then click on Edit. Scroll down the page until you reach the default Relay State field. Just beneath this, you'll find the Attribute Statements option. Click on Attribute Statements to expand the section and view the current configuration. This is where you'll find the Dynamic Attribute Statement configuration for your OIN SAML application. It is worth noting, however, that if your application was created using the SAML wizard, the Attribute Statement option can be found under the General tab of the application rather than the Sign-On tab. There you have it! You now know how to locate the Dynamic Attribute Statement configuration for OIN SAML applications. This should make it easier for you to manage and utilize additional attributes in your SAML applications. We hope you found this video helpful. Don't forget to check back often on Octus Support Playlist for more informative videos. If you have any questions or need further assistance, feel free to leave a comment or reach out to us directly. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.